What's up guys, my name is Nick, and welcome back to another Call of Duty World War 2 video. So for today's video, I'm going to be taking a look at the heroic variants for the Gewehr 43, the Nobel 2. I'm going to be taking a look at how it looks, how its perks and the gun performs in multiplayer and zombies, as well as how its iron sight differs from its base gun's iron sight, and how to get this gun, and is this gun worth it. So without further ado, let's get right into the video. So the Nobel 2, now this has to be one of the cleanest heroic variants for the Gewehr. So I don't know if this is the only heroic variant, but I really like how this heroic variant looks and it makes the Gewehr look like an amazing gun. So its iron sights isn't that different compared to the normal Gewehr. It's just, it's, I don't know, the the Nobel's is a little bit flatter, it's the best way I can explain it, and the Gewehr's is more bulkier. I, I, I don't know, it's just, they kind of look different, but they kind of don't. My vote honestly goes for the Gewehr's normal iron sight, because the Gewehr's normal iron sight, I don't know, to me is a lot better than this Nobel's version, because the Nobel's is a little bit too flat and all that. The Gewehr's is more big and open and bulky, like I guess... I guess I can say it like that. But the only way to get this variant is through the supply drop system, and not just the ordinary supply drop system, but the Winter Siege supply drops only as of this video was uploaded. I don't know if this variant will be added into the normal supply drops after weeks or months from this video being uploaded, but as of this video was uploaded, it's only exclusive to the Winter Siege supply drops. Now once you get this variant, I know you wonder, is this variant actually worth using? Now, let's break down that. First off, multiplayer. So it does have a multiplayer perk and it's 15% extra soldier XP. Now that is actually really noticeable with and without a double XP week or weekend. But at the moment, the Gewehr really, really sucks in core. In hardcore, it's actually really good, but it takes like three to four shots to kill somebody with the Gewehr in multiplayer which is really ridiculous and the Gewehr has a short amount of mags on it it's really sad how short of mags it has i don't know in the near future if they already buffed the Gewehr but as this video was uploaded the Gewehr actually pretty much sucks and it's kind of useless to use but it doesn't break the fact that this variant looks amazing and it does give you 15 percent extra xp when you get a kill so if it's sucking in multiplayer how does this gun perform in zombies so it doesn't have a zombies perk sadly but the Gewehr actually performs okay in zombies it doesn't take that many shots to kill a zombie but you gotta also know that it depends on what round you are i only got all the way up to round 10 with this gun and it started to take four to five shots to kill a zombie so that's why i'm saying Gewehr is kind of okay in zombies the only way to get this gun in zombies is through the mystery box and it's actually really hard to get because it's a freaking dlc weapon but if you're lucky you can instantly cop that thing in a mystery box and then boom you have the Gewehr but overall is this variant worth it so for multiplayer first not really as of this video was uploaded because the Gewehr pretty much sucks in multiplayer and there's no point of using the Gewehr and for zombies it's all a matter of you if you want to use it, it's your choice but in my opinion I don't recommend using the Gewehr in zombies there are way better guns and zombies that do more damage that are semi-auto than the Gewehr. Plus, there are actually some free semi-auto variants that actually have a zombies perk. Note the keyword, free. But that was basically pretty much it for this video, guys. And if you guys like this, drop a like. It helps me out a ton. And if you need to channel, subscribe for more music content. It's uploaded Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday. And remember to hit that bell and subscribe button so you don't miss an upload. I also pop a card to the series playlist right about now. The series is called Is This Variant Worth It? And I'm close to finishing all of the variants that have both a multiplayer and zombies perk. And then it's off to completing the multiplayer only perk ones. So I recommend checking out this playlist after this video is done. But again, guys, that was basically pretty much it for this video. And comment down below, what do you think of the Gewehr Noble 2? Do you like how it looks? Are you kind of mad that the Gewehr kind of sucks? Like any opinion around the Gewehr. I'd really like to know. But I hope you guys have an amazing day and I'll see you in my next one. So, peace guys.
Thank you.